that you're a guy who just right and I was <laughs> Okay. You get to pick a card, any card. So now they're gonna check what he's won. So he has won uh Mohito. Uh Amit, you should you blow about the yeah, that's uh, Mohito is strawberry and mango mojito. It's one of the popular Mohito in Coco Aranda. Right, alright then. Second question. Who was the first Miss Tweet? <laughs> and you can ask me yourself. Ah, 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 yeah. So, uh, I guess not everybody knows. That's uh, Vishmi R who was the first tweet, uh, Miss Tweet. And he has won uh, the cocoa sandwich. Amit, are you here? So, what I want to win? That is actually uh, uh, chicken mayo sandwich from the Chibara bread. So, okay, you are really lucky then. So, where am I? Oh, that's so he. Uh, anybody who's a friend of his is in for a chance so because. Me, Amit, you like I'll try it out. I'll pull it out. Okay, question number three. Where was the first we have held? People in the back, anyone? Just because I'm stubborn like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Who's there? Next to the guy in the pink shirt? Oh, wait. There's more. Okay, come up front. And you name it? Okay. Okay. <laughs> A lot of people want Gomi, to know today. They can follow you. Yeah, you need followers when you come up here. You you have to say or uh, handle out loud so that they know they can follow you. Yeah. You mean I'll do this? Okay. Do you mean? That's my life. Coco Aranda. All right. So the answer is Coco Aranda. Is it correct? Yeah, yeah. Yes, it's correct. Alright, let's see what he has got. This is big. I think it's a big gift. Oh, 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 oh. Alright! He's getting something very interesting. That's the DBC. <laughs> he won the DBC. Amit, where are you? Actually, I don't want to explain about it. Everybody knows about the DBC. Uh, Dead by chocolate in case anyone's wondering. Alright, you can enjoy that. Probably, I heard uh, someone did too much for you. What do you think of that? My goodness, uh, I'm not. Wait, you can give me half. I cannot get it. He wants to share the cake. He's a nice one. Okay, next question. Who was the first Mr. Tweet? Ghazali! 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 Pick the camera. Somebody from the back. Come, oh, I see. No, no, no. Pick from front. Oh, come on. I've got picked like four guys already. Three guys. Okay. <laughs> hey, Baba! Oh. She's popular. Now. Baba, you are sharing with me. Gaya, my name. What? 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 Gaya? What? <laughs> okay, and the answer to the question is? Oh, Gaya! Okay. That's, uh, uh, that's, whoa, whoa, that's whoa. The, that was the first Mr. Tweet. Apparently, he's the most popular, but he wasn't the first. He's not popular anymore. <laughs> Again, he's just jealous. <laughs> Alright, somebody else has the answer. Okay. Uh, actually, Okay, rebels at the back. Second wrong answer. Who knows the correct answer? Kamira. <laughs> and that is correct. What's your name? Kamira. Okay. Um. Take a card. There's only so, two Yeah, I don't buy it. So the first uh, Mr. and Ms. Tweep was uh, Tamira was Mr. Tweep and uh, Vishmiar was uh, Ms. Tweep.
and uh, let's see what he has got. Suspense is killing me. That's a pure chocolate cake. More chocolate. I mean, <laughs> hey, is anyone going to give me any of this? Yeah, of course. Uh, pure chocolate cake. It's, uh, it's actually like that by chocolate, but a little bit different. So you can enjoy it. So Are you going to share it or are you going to eat it alone? I'll eat it alone. <laughs> Alright. Enjoy. Last question and uh, I need two answers for this last question. The question is, name two members from the first Sweet Up Organizing Committee. Two, uh, name two members who are uh, were in the first tweet up organizing committee, but they can't be in this time's organizing committee. Tamar Singh and Salat Singh. Not bad. Oh, and not good. Ah, what is your name? Yeah. Mahali G A. Is it your boy? Gasly. Woo! Yeah. No, no, he's not related. He knows all about it. Yep. Okay. You don't put it in the car. Hey, put it in the car. Back point. Back point. If it's something chopped up, you'll have to give it to someone else because you know you need to make it a bigger man. You're talking. Yeah, yeah. It's okay, never mind. Of course, we have the principal sponsor. That would be Dialogue Arshrasa. That's right. If you're following them, it's Dialogue Arshrasa. You can complain to them, they don't mind. Yeah, I guess. Especially about him. Yeah, that's fine, yeah. And then we have also our uh, main food sponsor. I'm sure everybody ha enjoyed a nice cup of uh, noodles from uh, Prima Kotumi. Um, uh, other sponsors are Wild.LK. They handle anything LK. They're co-sponsors with Splashcom, yep. who are also co-sponsors, which I already said. Yes, plenty. So, uh, just so you know, uh, there is free Wi-Fi in case you didn't know. Alright, so we have something surprising here. Uh, we'd like to call upon uh, Gayan MW uh, because he might have some very depressing stories to share with us. Depressing? Yes, apparently uh, he must be feeling quite worried because he has been excluded from being uh, nominated Mr. Dweeb for this year. I don't think he's worried. I heard people at the back going Gayan Mr. Tweep again. Well, we totally understand let's, that. Let's but see what, what he has to say. Let's see what he has to say about not being uh, able to be nominated as Mr. Tweep. I'm sure he uh, spent quite uh, many sleepless nights. Gayan, over to you. Share with us your thoughts on uh, why, uh, what do you feel about being excluded from... Uh, okay, I have, a, I have a different question. I heard that you went and won another title since you couldn't get Mr. Tweet. <laughs> yeah, I actually lost I haven't won it actually, it was given to me. They forced it on you? Yes, all of them. Right, so what was it? Anju? I remember! Tell us a bit. Well, uh, uh, moving on to that, I have talked about uh, more some sort of cunning plan now, uh, excluding uh, some of the former dreams. <laughs> that was pretty nice, actually. Uh, uh, great to see new faces and everything. Uh, met a lot of people, and, uh, and uh, everything was really nice, obviously, and everything. Except for the voting part, of course. <laughs> and uh, really nice to meet you all, and thank you for inviting me. I don't know why. Uh, we invited you here because they like you. Well, well the fact is we want to know like what you feel from, uh, how you feel from being excluded from this category. More to the point, what do you feel about being here in the first place? Let's pick the good thing. <laughs> well, uh, you know, this is organized by uh, people who are actually working somewhere, who are families and everything. For organizing this, uh, they don't get anything. They just get the pleasure of organizing this. So this was been delayed, as you know, because people have other work, the organizing company and everything. But the time that they have spent on organizing this, inviting you all and your commitment of actually coming here, being part of this from different part of parts of the country, it shows that Twitter is a bit different from rest of the social media platform that we have. 
because the friendship that we make online actually become realized on the real world. And some of, some of my best friends that I have made here are actually, I have met them online. So really nice to be here and uh, how? <laughs> and uh, really nice to be here. So, uh, and to get back to your point about winning or anything, what's a good gesture? Friends, friends, friendships, good times, that's what it's all about. Such a touching speech. No wonder you won Miss Tweet. Did I just say Miss Tweet or no? We need you. We need you here for a little while longer. A few more questions. So, uh, so What's the secret? We all want to know. How do you keep winning stuff? <laughs> Uh, I really don't know. I mean, uh, I just tweet, uh, I just tweet along, and uh, my timeline is really good. I uh, I follow people like you know, not Jagat Sundar. I don't know whatever they call. <laughs> and uh, the timeline is what inspires people to tweet good stuff, right? Uh, seeing good things, then you are you are inspired to tweet good things. So following good people is tweeting good stuff. That's it. Okay, thanks, guys. Thank you. Thank you very much, guys. Now, I have been asked to call up a fairly controversial tweet. Siddhartha, are you here? He's not Jagat. He's not a lot of things, I think. <laughs> so, I'm pretty sure. Oh, okay. So, he has a lot of handles. Which of these do you follow? Uh, there is not Jagat. Uh, there is something else. We probably know what to say. It's actually not there. Uh, there, there is Siddhartha. Oh, and he, he, uh, the, uh, the second one, uh, my <laughs> not, uh, uh, what's the name of Okay, so while I'm talking here, he's busy doing something else actually. He, he has been waiting to do this ever since uh, the hype of Tweet Up SL started. He's been asking me who is this, who is this, who is this. Now only I saw Oh really? Yes. Now only I saw her. Come on. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, that's okay. <laughs> All right. So, so I didn't uh, just give him my number. Really? Oh. Can you hear me, Ma? Good. Okay. What? <laughs> what am I supposed to say? And is there any words that I should not say? <laughs> Anything I want. That's bad. Oh, uh, no. That's bad. No. Yeah. And they suddenly made me uh, laugh louder. So let's say uh, this is the fourth year of uh, Tweet Up SF. And uh, how many Tweet Ups have you been to with. Uh, been uh, to? What do you feel so far? How, how is the love from the tweets for you right now? When I joined Twitter, that was back in uh, 2009, but I was not active back then. Then 2011 came and I be started becoming active and... Uh, it was, I'll tell it, I'll tell what I'm saying to you personally tonight, okay? Okay, so, I'll use the... <laughs> Get into my <laughs> so classic. <laughs> okay, so what happened was uh, a few few people from Twitter, Yoshita, got them invited me to meet them, and that was the first time I met Tweets uh, in person. Then I realized how how real they are, even though we meet virtually. Yeah, Rusha was there, Malita was there, Paulita B was there. Uh, yeah, Chuck was there. Yeah, anyway. So fast forward about six months, then the second video happened. I went there. I was there, and uh, Jerry, where's Jerry? Jerry. Yeah, Jerry beat me to become the funniest tweet that year. Yeah, but the next year I won. Yay! <laughs> yes, and uh, what? This year I'm excluded. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Yes, but it's all right. You guys love me, and uh, actually, we all meet virtually. But I know you guys are among the most closest and realest. 
What? 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 I love all of you guys forever, maybe. Okay. Uh, so you I will love you a bit more. Uh, I'm flattered. Yes. You were supposedly the funniest tweet last year. Yes. Are you, have you still got it? I think I've lost it a bit this year. Yeah. Life has been a bit rough to me. So, uh, right. I've been quite lonely oh, and single for some time. <laughs> you know. Right. And if I'm not. And if I'm not... I didn't get it. If you're not what? Single! I was not asking whether you were single, come on! You're such a critical, you probably have uh, more than one boyfriend. <laughs> yes. yes! No, no, no. I was just asking her, Pumi girl, right? Pumi girl. She said no. Pumi! Okay, how many have you tried this on now? Uh, just Pumi. <laughs> She's pretty and she gives the best hugs. <laughs> she can't hear us though. Pumi, is that? There... I'm talking about you. <laughs> Let's call her up too. Pumi, do you mind coming up here? Pumi, they want you to come here. Come, come. Come, come on. You scared her off, sorry. Yeah. Who did that? Anyway, yes. Does Sharon understand you, know? <laughs> <laughs> We understand, okay. But, I'll bring you the I'll find you. Sure you will. Alright, uh, so that, uh, uh, Jagan, uh, you can go up here before you embarrass yourself anymore. Alright? Uh, and, uh, thank you for being here and sharing and some wonderful things. for keeping it real. Alright? Very, very real. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you, uh, Nasir. And uh, yeah, I, uh, if I can take a minute, I would like to thank the organizing committee as well. They have been doing a tremendous job behind the, behind the, behind the, what is the word? Behind our backs or something. They have, been, <laughs> they have been working really hard, I know. About you, Dandas, you know very well what is going on, right? Yes, yes, yes. So yeah, uh, so yeah, thanks, thanks a lot for them. They're not getting anything out of this, but they're doing this for us. Okay? Okay, thank you so much and enjoy the rest of your evening. And uh, if you guys did vote for me, clap harder. Okay, bye. <laughs> All right. So that was uh, Sudhatta, aka uh, Najagat. All right. So uh, I'd like to know uh, who among the tweets are from outstation, not from Colombo. Hands up. This one. So place it's the view. No, I, I mean to say that, you know, these guys would have taken many of their time to come up uh, with Alright, I know there is Gaul, there is uh, Kurunagal, anyone else? Saudi! Saudi! Saudi? Kurunagal! Listen! To what's your handle? Nisswar? Nisswar, Nisswar. Ah, Nisswar 786. Alright. It's getting old, okay. <laughs> right, okay. We'd like to call upon Ayesha. Where is Ayesha? Are you Ayesha? Where is she? Yeah, we're going to ask you a few questions. I might even let the audience ask you a few questions. Okay, she doesn't want you to ask a question. Um, okay. So, since you said don't, what would you like to know? <laughs> One question. Okay, she's been nice enough to agree to one question. What do you want to know? Mobile uh, number. Not her mobile number. That you can ask her later privately. If she kicks you in places. She didn't, shouldn't. That's up to her. Yes, so are you Ayesha Ayesh? So. Anybody have questions? Anybody? From Ayesha? Not from Ayesha. Okay, I have a question. So, what do you think about Tweet Abyssin? Tweet Abyssin? Well organized and uh, so 
All right, uh, we have something very interesting coming up. Uh, I'm pretty sure everybody here remembers or knows, uh, has heard of uh, Sarat, who uh, was one of the key uh, members of the organizing committee. Uh, as you all know, we, uh, he left this earth on, uh, okay, I forgot the name. We were uh, asking you all to nominate the digital marketer of the year. Uh, by uh, tagging Eco Colombo and the hashtag DMFL2013. Uh, and we have a contributor, uh, Honda underscore Puta. He has been tweeting uh, and uh, he has been selected as one of uh, the winners of a special gift courtesy of uh, Eco Colombo. Uh, if you already haven't nominated uh, the Digital Market of the Year, Kindly do so by using uh, tweeting to Eco Colombo. Follow them, uh, tweet to Eco Colombo with the hashtag DMSL2013. Uh, and, and, uh, 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 and get voting. All right, so where is Honda Puta? Or the underscore Puta? Can't forget the underscore there. All right, uh, thank you for uh, actually nominating. So, uh, what do you feel? Yeah, I feel pretty excited to come here. This is my first tweet episode. And, uh, yes, I'm really glad that I made friends here today. Most of I haven't met in person, but uh, I actually got the chance to meet in person. Thanks, guys. It was a lot of fun. And, yes, I nominated Chetaka, if I remember correct. Yes. All right. Let's uh, give him uh, some... Do I have to? Yes. Uh, okay, I'm pretty sure he's going to share it, so that's not. He's not going to okay. share it with me. You need to pose for a picture as well. <laughs> All right. This is courtesy of uh, Eco Colombo. If you are not following them already, uh, do follow them. They are an upcoming uh, digital marketing company in uh, Sri Lanka. All right. Uh, as you all know, I was uh, telling you all about uh, Sarah. And uh, he has been with us. He's a good friend of ours. He has. Ihan Gamas, we'd appreciate if you'd also come forward here, please. Hajra, also come forward, please. Uh, uh, Miss Roshini would have come forward to collect this one to get. Uh, can Moshanti please come forward? Moshanti? Moshanti? Moshanti, we would appreciate if you would come forward uh, to hand over this gift to Roshini, uh, Sarat's uh, wife. We would appreciate if you would come forward. Guys, please don't leave here because the most exciting uh, part of the event is happening next. Melinda, if you are around, please come forward as well. You are also part of the uh, organizing committee. Alright, uh, so before we hand over this uh, wonderful plot, in memory of uh, Sarat Khatya Murthy, but, uh, uh, he has been a great help to uh, Tweet Up SL and the organizing team. He's, helped, uh, he's always welcome when we go to uh, Kupo to make our plans. So I'd appreciate uh, if everyone could uh, kindly stand up and let's uh, observe one minute silence uh, in memory of him. Right, thank you everyone. Uh, right, then we'll call upon uh, Mushanti to give the lovely plot in memory of Sarat. Uh, Mushanti is also a very good friend of uh, Sarat. Uh, kindly hand it over to Mushanti. Thank you very much uh, for being here. And, uh,
All right, so we have, uh, can we have the volunteers uh, quickly running over to the Prima Kutumi station and uh, bringing over the Prima cups that are ready. Let's start, uh, get on to the Dodo race. Uh, there again we got couples, all right. We need the couples coming in and uh, move back. <laughs> All right, you cannot move. You cannot move from where you are standing. Keep your hands at the back. All right. Uh, why don't you guys also stand? Go back. Go back. 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 All right. So this side, this side will run and feed these people. You have to keep your hands at the back and do not touch the cup. If you touch the cup, you are disqualified. You have to feed with the form that is given. Alright? Alright? And once you finish, as soon as you finish feeding it, you have to come back. Alright? The first person to reach this point is back to the starting line, is the uh, winner. Two winners. You can either run back with the cup. Uh, all right, let's take it into thing. You do. Have, you have to run back with the cup. If there's even one piece of noodle left, if there's at least one piece of noodle left in the cup, you are not eligible to win. All right. No spoon. It's a fork. All right. Hands at the back. Hands at the back. Are we ready? Yeah, there will be two winners. First player, then second player. Oh yeah. The other thing. You have to feed them. You can't eat them. Alright? You have to feed them. If any of you decide to... Two couples. Two couples. Are you happy? Are you happy? Are you happy? Are you happy? Sorry, do we have another cup? Dush? Take it. 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 Take one line please. One line. Alright, are we ready? When I say go, you have to run. Alright? Hands at the back. Guys. Hands behind. Do not do not even attempt to touch. Alright. Go! Do not go forward! So we've kind of lost you. Might want to come back this way because the awards are happening. Yeah, so the uh, award ceremony, the reason why uh, all of you guys have been waiting for so long because there's nothing happening afterwards, right? Great. So before we start the award ceremony, just a quick, uh, well, a quick note from our sponsors. Basically, uh, uh, at MDPS Live, uh, it's the gift shop in Sri Lanka. Uh, recently organized a competition where they gave uh, our two prizes, one for their 100 follower and the other one for their 125th follower. 
So the hundredth follower was Shafan Pfizer. Handle is Kazisha. Oh, yeah, Kazisha. All right. Can we have uh, Shafan Pfizer? A round of applause for Shafan. And the 125th follower. Romana Salim, uh, handle at Romana underscore. Romana Salim. Congratulations and your prize. Okay, so we are about to get down to it. The uh, much awaited award ceremony. I mean, there are supposed to be like. 750 people. Yeah, I only see around uh, around 382. You counted? I counted. Uh, Alright, so how many of you guys voted? Did anyone? One, two, three, four. That's like 15 people who voted here. You guys over there? Hello? You guys voted? Did you guys vote? Are you boycotting the vote? Are you protesting the process of democracy? Can you come closer please? This is not a democracy any longer. For the next two hours this is going to be an autocracy. You can come from up here. The closer the better. Alright, so... Uh, um, yeah, that's <laughs> bad. Uh, so we have uh, how many awards today? We have uh, 13 awards, uh, lucky numbers. Okay. Thirteen categories. So we have thirty. We have actually got thirty-nine awards. Thirty-nine awards. That's three awards per category, right? And before we start, do you want to read out the category? So the category that uh, we all know about. The first one is Mr. Tweet. Mr. Tweet. Ooh. A lot of competition for Mr. Tweet, huh? See a lot of Misters out there. Yeah, more Misters than Misters. Right. And uh, the next one. The next one is, hey, we had Mr. Tweep, what do you think's next? Mrs. Tweep? Mrs. Tweep, no, they've gone politically correct, it's Ms. Tweep. Next one is Tech Tweep. Uh, okay, we have the Tech Tweep, and then we have the Twitterholic Tweep. I guess the others aren't Twitterholics then, is is that right? Or is that some, someone who's especially, especially addicted to Twitter? Is that? Yeah, you know the person no. who tweets from bed, tweets from the loo. Good morning. About to get out of bed now. Yeah, that one. We all know one of those. Shouldn't have had a glass of water last night. <laughs> I can't sleep anymore. And the next award? Is the funniest tweet. The funniest tweet? Is there a lot of competition for funniest tweet this time? What do you guys think? The guys who voted? Who voted again? There's like five people here who voted. Did you vote? Can we have a show of hands please? Who voted? Oh, I said no one voted. One wow. person voted, I saw one hand. Like a stuff of three hands. You know the funny thing about Twitter is that I noticed this last time as well. When I go on Twitter and like click on like so you go to the home page and there's like thousands of tweets every second and everyone's just shouting and chatting and you know poking fun of each other and just Pouring out a lot of inane stuff right? every day. I mean, intelligent stuff, but sometimes it's just over and over again, a lot of chatter. So, I thought these guys are a bunch of, I mean, a really bunch of, you know, a big, big bunch of talkers. We're a lot better at it on Twitter. Well, I'm pretty silent on Twitter, actually. Goes to show, that's why you talk so much in real life. Okay, so since no one voted, uh, what do we do about the vote? Let's take them all home. Sounds like a good idea. Shall we finish this off? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, we're wrapping it up right now. We're like taking the awards with us. The awards after that are the Sportaholic Tweet, Instagramaholic, Hoodie Tweet, Hashtagaholic, Diplo Tweet, Diplo Tweet, hmm. uh, Most Controversial Tweet. It's nice how those two are together, you know. Diplo Tweet and Most Controversial Tweet. I wonder what will happen if they have, uh, they have both of them at the same time on stage. Let's find out. That's, oh, that's actually a good idea. Most Helpful Tweet. And uh, Twitter Newsbreaker of the Year. Uh, okay then, uh, what do we start with? Okay.
Okay, so we are going to start off with the Instagrammer Holik tweet. I personally think Holik is like a good candidate for that. Thank you very much. I tried fixing the votes. I spoke to many people who are doing the website. Well, oh, that's what you were doing running around here. Well, no, no, I did this before. Uh, the run-up okay, to the tweet. Yeah, I tried doing all that stuff. But, yeah. but all right, so how many of you guys voted for Instagrammer Holik? How many of you are on One, Instagram? One, two, three, four. Uh, oh, okay, so a lot of people voted for Instagram Holly. Is that right? So, how many of these people are actually on Instagram? So, a lot of people are on Instagram, that's great. So, you actually follow the person you voted for on Instagram? What did you do? Did you know? Any word for this? I don't know. It's not the So, uh, we also have the second and third penis. Of course, you're not alone. Alright, so we have uh, Angela Fernando, Angela F, uh, coming in on second place. And uh, Aishmark on third place. So guys, please come forward. Uh, uh, we would we'll appreciate if uh, Ro Ms. Roshini comes forward to give the first place award to Halik Aziz. So we have uh, a lovely uh, 10,000 rupee gift voucher from uh, Coco Varanda in, uh, in memory of uh, Sarat Satyamurti and uh, also uh, NFC key tag from Digit. And a lovely uh, mug uh, from MDPS Live. Nice to have you back, Harlik. All right, the second place. Sorry about the surprise there. It was kind of surprising, actually, because really? I wasn't was really expecting well. it. But yeah. thank you very much, and uh, I guess my vote fixing process worked. All right, Monica. You want to come over to the back because they want you away. Angela F. Angela Fernando, come over here and get your prize. And, uh, yeah. Just one second, and we figure out who's going to give you. Hang on, it's your birthday? Happy birthday. Oh, it's your birthday, all right. Her gift is coming to her from the U.S. Embassy in Colombo, and and Mufada Homni. It's a long wait for her gift. It's hold out for later, by now. It's probably worth waiting for. Them. Looks really big, much bigger than the first place. I wish I was the second Okay. I have no idea how to pronounce your name, I'm sorry. Aishmark, yeah? Aishmark, with Aishmark. all the Q, I think. Aishmark. And there she is, Aishmark, number three, Instagram and all of you. I'm personally a big fan of your. Very nice to meet you, too, finally. And uh, personally, a big fan of your Instagram, actually. Thank you very much. Thank you. If I can um, interrupt the fan yeah, calling for a moment. Um, she is winning a lovely voucher from Shirkanath. So, congratulations, Aishma. Congratulations, and um, don't go away because we have a few more prizes coming up today, like about 12 more. 12 categories. 12 categories, and oh yeah, that's like 39, 36 prizes. Okay. Alright, now tell me, honestly, how many of you guys voted? Yeah, money to make the vote. Thank you very much. Money to my only fan in the house. Okay, so uh, the next award we have Mr. Tweep. This tweet, we have a whole okay. bunch of categories. But before we get into all that, we have a lucky winner from Order Food. Wow, a lucky winner. Wow. Well, we have more two actually. It's more information. All I know is that they're lucky and they won. And uh, Order Food is going to give them a prize. Alright, so we have two people who are lucky and they won. They won they two won. vouchers each. They want two vouchers each uh, from www.orderfood.ak. And who and, want? Uh, one of them is Gaganin. Can we have Gaganin over here, please? If someone says Gaganin, is Gaganin in the house? Please don't impersonate Gaganin. We, want we know what Gaganin looks like. 
<laughs> I totally know what he looks like. I mean, she, what she looks like. Okay, Gaganin left, I guess. So who gets Gaganin's prize? Anyone wants to collect this on behalf of Gaganin? Is foot, free foot. Do you know Gaganin? Anyone, anyone here friendly with Gaganin? No, friends with Gaganin? Anyone who meets Gaganin in real life? No one. You're talking about tweets. All right, so the free food goes back to the uh, organizing company. It's a 10% discount offered by Coco Miranda for anyone wearing the Tweet Up SL4 T-shirt. So I guess we can all roll down to Coco Miranda afterwards. All right. So it's actually uh, if uh, you are wearing the Tweet Up SL T-shirt, this time Tweet Up SL T-shirt, you can either walk into uh, Coco Miranda Chris Cat. Uh, to a board place and enjoy 10% off on anything that you purchase. Alright, this is courtesy of uh, Coco Veranda and uh, how they say thank you for doing the best sales. And is that on any day, any day they want, any time they want? Uh, only today, only today. So you can like walk in next week and ask for a 10% discount because they are not going to give it to you. Okay? <laughs> Alright, so uh, okay, we one have, more. But before we go to the next person, uh, there is someone who wants to collect it on behalf of Coverage. Uh, can we have Lahiru Nirmal over here, please? Lahiru Nirmal. All right, he's over here. Congratulations, you won. You didn't win, but I can say at least it's a bit lucky. You'll probably get half. Congrats, man. I hope you give that to Kagarina, at least tell her that you got it. Okay. Next person to win from orderfood.lk is Unpass. Unpass, oh, popular guy, all right. Let's get it for Unpass. <laughs> and in third place. In third place for Diplo Tweet, Tweet Up SL4 2013. We have Guyon MW. Guyon MW! Where's Gayan? Let me see Gayan, make way for Gayan. Great. Why aren't you wearing your t-shirt, Gayan? Why aren't you wearing your t-shirt? Gayan, you give back. You give back on to you kind of see the US Embassy in Kanaka. Awarded by Pudumabi to Gayan MW. Congratulations, Gayan. In second place. In second place, the prize is again courtesy of the US Embassy of Sri Lanka. We have uh, Loshan ARV. Loshan ARV. Can we have you on the stage, please? Loshan ARV. Loshan ARV has left. He has left the building. So, uh, does anyone else get the prize on behalf of him or a friend of Loshan ARV? There we go. We have Midarsan over here collecting the prize on behalf of Loshan. Can we hear you for Loshan, represented by Midarsan? Uh, they're going to get a, he's going to get a mug from MDPS Live, a Bluetooth keyboard, and one Wi-Fi portable router. Man, these things are awesome. How come? Wow. Oh. Amazing gifts right there. All right. I'm not jealous at all. Diplo Tweep of the Year. Who's the Diplo Tweep of the Year? The Diplo Tweep of the Year is Nissan Sir DS. Nissan Sir DS. Yes. Congratulations. You know something about uh, you are a particular brand of diplomacy. Is it anything, you know, anything resembling uh, Doctor Doctor Nornis, do you do you like are you one of the you know, are you one of his followers or you admire him or is your brand of diplomacy different to him? I mean what what uh, you know what, what defines your diplomacy? Uh, my diplomacy defines uh, by fighting most of the time. I yes, I fight with most of the people and I do not know why they have ordered me as diplomatic. Maybe you fight diplomatically? Most probably. 
We're going to ask you to stick around for a little while. Don't go too far. Yeah, but you can collect your prices, I guess. You can do that. Yeah, your long list of prices because I think Pudumali's arms are hurting by carrying them on this time. So, congratulations. Can you hear it for this chance with us? Okay. Now, we to go very well with that, we've got the most controversial tweet coming up. In third place. In third place, we have uh, Rath Gamaya. Congratulations, Rath Gamaya. Collect your prize. Launch your phone, Jokan and launch. Before you go, can you tell us why you, why you think you won this award? Why do you tweet about it? I don't know. So you don't know what you tweet about. He doesn't know what he tweets about. That may be why he's so controversial. Maybe you should really start wondering about what you tweet about. And feel Manyang here. He feels Manyang here. You should tweet that. Congratulations, Radka Maya. Can you hear it by one more time, please? All right. May you get more controversial as the years go by. We have a notorious character who I know quite personally. Shamas Gauss. Is Shamas Gauss in the house? Shamas Gauss is in the house. Okay. And we have a prize for Shamas from, from the US Embassy again. Before you go, can you tell me why people think you are controversial? I really don't know, but I'm very pretty. I've been pretty for some things. Pretty in terms of what? Politics or something else? Or? Yeah, politics. Um, I think you're already pretty much trouble if you're tweeting as much as you, I mean, you know, as controversial as to get a word for it, but. Uh, it was a good show, and can we hear it for Shamas Gauss one more time? Thank you. And as most controversial tweet, who do you think it is? Who, who do you guys think is the most controversial tweet? I mean, he's the most, or she, or he, or she is the most controversial tweet today. For the whole of last year, he's been, or she's been, I think I'm taking away half the plot here, but. He's been the most controversial player for one whole year. Yeah. Press Raja Baksu, who's that? President. Oh, the president? Yeah, yeah. No, 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 not the president. I think there's uh, the president satire. represented it. There's also a satire account. Oh, Press Raja Baksu is a satire account. Well, there's both. You can't hear me. Oh, yeah. Can you all hear me now? Can you hear Sharon? Uh, Okay, you can hear me, but you can't hear him. That's got to be selective hearing somewhere there. It's probably a good thing, no? All things considered. <laughs> Shall we move on to the award? Yeah, the award for the most controversial tweet of 2013 goes to not Jagat. Is it not Jagat? Yeah, it's not Jagat. Hang on. I know you, you're Sudat. You're not Jagat. Can we have not Jagat here, please? You're not Jagat, right? So you're not Jagat. You, you're not Jagat. Yes, yes, I'm not Jagat. So we want a guy called Jagat here, right? No, we want not Jagat. We want not Jagat. We don't want Jagat. So we don't want you. But it's not Jagat, so we do. Okay, you can come back. You can come back. You can come back. I'm sorry. And here's your heart. Okay. All right, so not Jagat gets a mug from MDPS Live plus a gift pack from Foodlink 2 and a NFC G tag. The bronze that right behind. Getting it now. An NFC G tag. Wait, 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 before you go. Oh, um, yeah, you won. Oh! <laughs> I didn't know that! Thank you! Thank well, yeah, why do you think you came up here then? I don't think I'm going to call up three more people than three people. But we already did that. We called two people up. Thank you so much. I can't believe you know how to call you.
So wait, 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 no, hang on. Uh, what about your account? I hear a lot of the ladies like your tweets. Obviously, look at him. <laughs> I got nothing to say to that. Just look at him. I mean, come on. Why would not the ladies like him? All right. Now, Jagat, thank you very much. And can we hear it for him one more time, please? Most controversial tweet of the year. Is that yeah. your 70 heroes? Jerry? It's 17, right? Last time I checked? No? He's been checking. I've been checking. I've been checking. Okay. What? Okay then, moving, moving on. on. <laughs> the next category is Sportaholic. Sportaholic queen. You know those guys who, I mean, when you go on your home page, you will like get about 10 tweets from Manchester United, suddenly on your what? I mean, like, what? And then you have, uh, you know, every five minutes you have a place on the picket match. You know, we're talking about those lovable characters here, those guys who completely spam your timeline with, uh, with, with a lot of sports events. Sports events were happening. Without them, we wouldn't know most of the sports events. Yeah, we, we wouldn't unless you put the TV on. Who has time for that? Who has time for that? Exactly. And that's why we come to Twitter to watch sports, right? Totally. Great. Uh, yeah. But these guys are, I mean, I wouldn't call them spammers. They're probably being voted by you guys because they're probably uh, the most informative tweets when it comes to sports. Exactly. And in third place for Sportaholic Tweet is. Varunasi. Okay, can we call Bihan Gamos to come up and uh, give the gift to Asanga Rocks representing uh, Varunasi? Uh, the, the third place gets a voucher from Chokanath Launch presented by Bihan to Varunasi representative. Thank you very much. Bihan, stick around. We want you to give the next one as well. <laughs> Second place for Sportaholic Tweet is uh, the gift pack from the U.S. Embassy and also an NFC tag from Digit. In second place is, you want to tell us? Yeah, the second place is Shashika24, Shashika Tabakku. Congratulations. Okay, uh, I need to ask you a few questions. What do you think you did to deserve the Sportaholic second place? <laughs> what was that? What do you think? I prefer the Twitter. And what's your favorite cricket team? Definitely Sri Lanka. Definitely Sri Lanka. Great. Is that your eyes in there because you are in Sri Lanka right now or do you really like Sri Lanka? You got a patriot in the house guys, come on, let me hear you for him please. Second place, uh, Sportaholic Creep of the Year and for the first place. First place for Sportaholic Tweet of the Year. 2013, Tweet of the SL4, let's make it a little bit more formal, a little bit more exciting. Can we have um, Takashi G? Sports, a lady. Wow. I'm sorry, I was a little sexist. Congratulations. Oh, you want to have a chat with you while you're running away? Why is that? That's how she became sportaholic. She ran around. Okay. News on Twitter, huh? So we have like newscasters, like journalists on Twitter, so they're like journalists. Yeah, there are people who are journalists on Twitter, but these are people on Twitter who are journalists. Right? They could be both. They could be both. Alright, that's a very... And uh, to hand out the award for the uh, Twitter Newsbreakers of the Year, we have Joita and Julian from the U.S. Embassy. Julian, I'll speak. Hello. Hi, everybody. <laughs> I'm Juliana Spaven. I'm the uh, press officer for the U.S. Embassy here in Colombo. And this is Joe Witter. 
Hey, I'm Joe Winters. Call me Joe Twitters if you want. Uh, I get paid to tweet. Anybody else get paid to tweet out there? You know, no. he actually has a totally full job. <laughs> There's somebody. Right. Yeah, so we're here. Um, Joe's actually out from Washington, D.C., which is totally awesome. We're all the way out here to visit you guys. Yeah. For the tweet I missed. Uh, I saw I saw yeah. 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 I saw that I missed out on the uh, flash bump. Can we redo that again? Redo that? No. Okay. So, listen. Uh, we love to support this. We love to be here. And we have a lot of great things we want to talk about really quickly. We have 140 characters or less. Good job. Juliana. What I really want for all of you guys is take out your, your iPods, your iPads, your iPods, your iPads, your iPhones, all your technical devices, and plug in on Twitter. Follow USMSL. So there's a number of things that we're doing this year, and starting next year, they're going to be totally awesome. Um, the biggest thing is starting in January, um, we're going to start, we're going to launch Social Media Lab. So we're going to start teaching. Um, courses on social media. So how many of you guys out there have parents who are like, what do you, what's Twitter and, and how does it work? Anybody? Yeah. Okay. All right. Awesome. Look at all these people. Great. So your parents are the audience. Okay. What we're trying to do is teach everyday Sri Lankans who are not the Twitterati, who are not the peeps that are here today. We're trying to teach everyday Sri Lankans how to use social media. And so we've got these courses that we're going to be launching in January. My man Prasad, right there, the USMC. He's going to be teaching these courses. We've also got intermediate and we've got advanced courses. So this is your chance to learn what's the latest and greatest technology coming out of the United States. How do you do it? How do you use it to your advantage? How do you create a competitive advantage? So, like I said, you want to start following, if you haven't already, start following USMSL on Twitter because that's where we'll be posting when our courses start and all that stuff. So, please do that. But otherwise, we are here to present... The Newsbreaker. The Newsbreaker of the Year Award. All right. The News, yeah, the Newsbreaker on Twitter of the Year Award. So, number three runner-up is... Drum roll, please. Uh, Azam Amin. Where's Azam Amin? No, uh, My brother. You're, yep, you're representing? Okay, great. <laughs> great. Uh, congratulations. Cool. Runner, or number two is Crazy Nolan. Best Twitter fan. Wow. And first place is Ranga Sriral. Ranga, Rangaba. Rangaba. Rangaba is also not here. Any representative? <laughs> Great. Well, thank you so much. Um, thanks for uh, thanks for all the awesome tweets this whole year. Um, and we're looking forward to being here next year, or yeah, in 2014. Please come say hi to us. Looking forward to meeting. Thank you. Thank you very much, and Sorry, Meetup SL5 is going to be much more crowded than this, I guess, if your project works. Sincerely hope it does. Alright, so none of the newsbreakers were uh, you know, here today. It's very strange, Janu is making a, a disappear again. That is very strange. They probably just all covering some sort of story, right? Okay, so the crowd, uh, we have roughly around how many people? 250? Are you guys, are you guys okay? Are you guys Bored? Are you guys mildly interested? Are you guys really interested? Hungry. You're hungry? Okay. I was going to go with that one. How was the film about to me? It was good. Oh, that's some kutu spin right here as well. I must be getting crazy with the kutu. The okay. organizing committee for this year's Twitter is going to present the check to water with a difference of 50,000 rupees. 50,000 rupees? Wow. All right, so that's 50,000 rupees donated to a very really worthy cause by you guys. You can pat yourselves on the back. Well done. 
Actually, I have no idea. I just wanted for the sake of it because uh, I didn't see any help with it. So my, my time. <laughs> well, now I'm going to honest. What's your, what's your handle? It's Charter Kumbia. Charter Kumbia? All right, next. You can see there are a lot of people out there helpful and personally on my timeline, I do have a lot of very helpful tweets, guys who respond in a, uh, in a, in a real hurry when I have a question or something like that. So, they are definitely the helpful tweets. Something. I have another question. Oh, I'm going to pull up a question. So, in third place, for most helpful tweets, the tweet of SL4 is Sukiri. Sukiri. Sukiri here? Sukiri is not here. A lot of the award winners are not here to collect the awards. Why is that? Are they shy? She's busy helping, helping people. Okay. All right, anyone who wants to represent Sukiri? All right, it's uh, the man of the hour, Nissan's uh, DDS. Second place, the most helpful tweet. As he left the building. Nissan has left the building, okay. And we have number one for most helpful tweet, Anfas JM. Alright, it's a 2 9 winner again, right? Alright, so we have a gift from Rodel K with uh, 5,000 rupees worth of hotel vouchers together with the NFC key tag. Congratulations. By the way, I think uh, actually most helpful to it is him. Okay. It's Gopi. Gopi has the help. I agree. Gopi has the help. Gopi has the population thing you can get. But, but, come on, why, why did they think you are the most helpful people? I don't know who vote for me, but I will find every one of you and I will give it to you, okay? But I don't know who, who vote for me, okay? I vote for you. I vote for you, so you can give me a treat after we are done. Alright, so no one voted for him, no one voted for me, that's great, that's wonderful, nice to see people fixing the balance, more people than one, sorry. Alright, so congratulations on pass, two time winner, alright. Uh, we have um, the next, next award. In second place is Takashi G. Takashi G, seven time winner. And she ran away as if she was leaving but she's still here. We'll keep her this time to ask her a few questions. She's getting a free meal from Chakanath Lounge. And please stay here and answer our questions this time. So sports and food. What do sports and food have in common? She enjoys both. So what kind of sports do you enjoy? Uh, and, and and anything else? Nothing else. So like five, wait, and, and food, what kind of food do you like? Anything, anything? And not poisonous. And not poisonous. That's exactly the same kind of food I like. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright. Congratulations, Savindri Di Barrera. Is Samindri in the house? Unfortunately, she's not in the country. Oh, she's not in the country. Can we ask someone to represent Someone her? representing Samindri. Anyone who's friends with Samindri? Anyone who knows Samindri? Do you want to say something funny before you go? That's a philosopher as well as a funny man. Good. Situationally funny person. Ah, something to think about. In first place. First place for funniest tweet of 2013 is uh, Najagat still around? Najagat, can we have you over here, please? For the funniest tweet of the year. Because why did you decide to sponsor this gift, Najagat? Uh, because uh, I'm not getting it this time, so I want to be on the stage when that name. Uh, what do you mean you're not getting it this time? Did you get it last time? Yes, yeah, I beat Jerry to that. You beat who? Jerry. Jerry, where is Jerry? Over here. But Jerry's not funny, I know Jerry. Exactly, I'm funny. So you're funnier than the least funniest person I know? That's bad, I know. Okay, generally it's agreed that you're sort of funny. I've seen your video, alright, I mean you. Make me crack a grin sometimes, so I guess that's okay. But Nojagat, this time because he deeply resents the fact that 
he wasn't allowed to win or he wasn't even eligible for the prize. He sponsored the prize this time for the winner. What a generous, generous guy. Okay, he's funny. Naujagat knows this. And you guys might want to, you know, get a room. <laughs> Congratulations, Patkamaya uh, again. And that's a nice t-shirt you have there. Okay. Purna CW. Hashtagaholic of the year in second place for 2013 Purna CW. Winning a gift bag from the US Embassy as well as an NFTP bag. Purna's missing as well. Okay. Is there anyone who would uh, represent Purna? Friends of Purna. Friends of Friends of Purna. Congratulations. And uh, now we have the first place for hashtag Aholic of the Year. Huh? It usually comes up Does it? Depends on which order you go. But then the, this like problem with hashtags, I mean, I like hashtags. I mean, they're very informative. They, they, they are very good at categorizing tweets, you know, you know what a tweet is about when someone has a hashtag. It's annoying when they are overused, aren't they? You mean hashtag aholic overused. Is that right though? Do you think hashtag aholics overuse hashtags? Yes, no, maybe. Take, take alcoholic. Do they uh, overuse alcohol? You're right, you're right. I guess it's right. So it's actually hashtag abusers who win the hashtag aholic of the year. But why are they winning a prize? Then is it a good We're thing? We're encouraging it. We're encouraging it. Okay, we're encouraging hashtag addiction. And uh, the first place winner for hashtag aholic of the year is N. Hirans. <laughs> Congratulations, Iran. <laughs> <laughs> you have a mark, uh, object from Portlink and the NFC key tag. Hold on. Uh, why do you use hashtags? Define a topic, right? You define a topic, right? That's what I've said. How many hashtags? I have my own few tags. What are your own tags? Just Hiran, no Hiran says. So what does Hiran say? <laughs> How do you spell that? W E E E E. Let's be. As in all of us. Uh, from all of us here at Twitter Pestel 4, right? Everyone at Twitter Pestel 4. Including all of you guys, even if you didn't know about it, it's coming out from you guys, from everyone in the organizing committee, basically all, it's, everyone on Twitter. It's going on to a very, very helpful. A uh, very, very helpful tweet. Uh, okay, so there was a competition for the digital marketer of the year from Echo Colombo. Of course I know. I know everything. I know a lot of, I know this thing. Okay. But I mean, I'll let you, I'll let you go ahead and ask my name because I, you clearly want to. Get the curve. All right. Congratulations. Twitter, you talked about people not talking much in, is Ayesha. Ayesha. A loud round of applause. So, your name is Aisha and you're a Twitter holic? You don't know. That's alright. A lot of alcoholics don't know that they're alcoholics either. I mean, the first step is admitting the problem. She's on the way there. According, yeah, as well as an NFC uh, P tag from Digital K. Thank you very much. IA5 Hawk. Okay, second place for Twitter holic of the year. Is Table Dosa in the house? I'll settle for a masala dosa. Congratulations to paper dosa wherever she is. And number number one. The craziest Twitter holic of them all, who tweets all the time, is Gayan MW. Gayan MW is a former Mr. Tweet winner and you already won the prize today. And now he's here he is winning his second prize of the day. So, Gan, 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 how many tweets? Uh, how many tweets do you put out for a day? Uh, first, uh, I got 
the colleagues come in and they stuff. Thank you for that. Thank you for pointing it out because no one was saying anything. You were just going on about it. The thing is, uh, for instance, uh, hashtag Mahali. I think uh, it's about creating new hashtags and creating a trend. So I think in Twitter uh, and Twitter, uh, when it comes to Twitter Mahali, it's completely like alcoholic stuff. Right? It's like complete uh, addiction. So uh, I have to clear that. So you're addicted to Twitter, basically. So it's like, you know, like talking with people. So basically when we have some comment, something uh, happening in the country or something, a topic that, that's going on, catching on. So people like to contribute and things like that. We've been tweeting for a while, but there are people who have been Thank you very much, Gan, for that very informative speech. I learned a lot from that. Thank you very much. And uh, so the hashtag Alex are off the hook. Yeah. And your prize is again from the U.S. Embassy of Sri Lanka. And digital kids and everything. Thank you very much. Uh, what do you tweet about most in terms of technology? Mostly the mobile tech. Nexus. Yes. Nexus 4. Nexus phones. You're a fan of Nexus devices? I'm a fan of Nexus devices too. All right, in second place is Tamira. Where's Tamira? I saw him a little while ago. He's hiding. Oh, he's coming. The man is here. Take three, huh? Congratulations, Tamira. Your prize is uh, and uh, from Digital Kia and M MDPS. Uh, so, uh, I think everybody knows Gazli uh, pretty much. If you are on Facebook with him, uh, everybody uh, would know, I mean, he's got enough money from Facebook itself for finding bugs and probably he's hacking into Facebook too. So, but uh, I think we all should give him a big round of applause for the first Sri Lankan to be able to uh, find bugs on Facebook and get a bounty for it. All right. Okay, so we are nearing the end of uh, today's award ceremony. And uh, we need to have a drum over here because we need some drum rolls for the next two awards. The major awards of the Sri Lankan Twitter Sphere. Can we hear it for Mr. and Mrs. Miss Tweep, please? A round of applause. You want to find out who Mr. and Miss Tweep is today? No? You don't want to find out who it is? Are you guys excited about these awards? Come on, let me hear some excitement. Otherwise, we know that this was the that. most controversial award of all this year. Why is that? Because a lot of people wanted to give it to, well, certain people and they weren't allowed. And so is this like not Jagat all over again? Not Jagat? Not Jagat is very easy talking to a girl. Alright. So, so, very controversial this year, huh? Yeah. Really <laughs> fought for. Really fought for. Mr. Tweet. And I actually heard a few people were campaigning for the award. Approaching people, soliciting votes, really getting into the grassroots, you know, activism, organization aspect of it as well. You know, a lot of, you know, hard work going into getting these awards this time. Yeah, I saw a few girls over here, so I'm going to go ask them, did they vote for Mr. Tweet? I did not. They are nodding, so let me come over here. I can right? I'm going to ask you, what do you think makes a good Mr. Tweet? Uh, I think uh, on, on Mati Tweet, like, it should be uh, very active and funny and all diplomatic everything. Basically, like Mr. Tweet should be everything. Should be, he should be a combination of all the other awards, basically. Yes. The that's greatest a lot. Tweet, uh, male Tweet ever. Wow, that's a, that's a big, uh, I mean, a big bunch of categories to uh, fill, no? I mean, yes. what did you say? So, right. so you want to... You want to hear who Mr. Tweet is? Want to get on with the prizes for Mr. Tweet 2013, about that Tweet Up SL4. So, 
Okay, so. Alright, so we are going to do this a little bit differently. We are going to get the nominees. We are going to get the nominees out here today. Uh, the three most popular men on Twitter. In no particular order. Wow. I still kind of intimidated now. Because I'm on Twitter as well, you know. And you're not popular at all. I'm not popular apparently. Alright. <coughs> then we have, in no particular order, <laughs> Nissan <Sir> DDS. <laughs> In absentia, not here. Okay. Dodan, one, two, three. Is Dodan in the house? Okay, Dodan's coming over here. And Budumali. Budumali. Can we have who here, please? Thank you very much. So we have three people here. Yes. Well, we have three present, but one in spirit. What? So. Donna, what do you think uh, you did to become Mr. Tweet? Well, uh, nominated for Mr. Tweet? Don't utilize him! <laughs> well, I always wanted to make a difference from the background that I'm in. So I think, uh, and I have to say I didn't campaign for uh, anything. I didn't ask anyone for what. Actually, I don't know that I have this until these people told me not to do. Thank you. And, uh, yeah, that's about it. Let's hear from the next nominee, Budmati. Yeah. Why do you think you should be Mr. Tweet? I have no idea why you people have voted me. Uh, but maybe you guys like the tweet and I just want to hear something else about the Buddha tips and the Buddha talk. Which I feel like a lot of people are checking with me like, you know, where these things come from. Some <laughs> yeah, people say it's control V, control, control C, control V, but it's not really, you know, like maybe 20%, 30% from that, and the rest is localized facts. And thank you very much for whoever voted. I think there are a lot of tweets more deserved for this, but anyway, thank you very much. Very modest, Mr. Potential, Mr. Pip, there you never know. Both of them. Both of them. Both of very them. modest. Maybe that's why they like them. So, who do you think of the two of them is going to be... And Nisanta DDS, don't forget Nisanta DDS, just pretend standing here. Ha, like you want to pretend to be I'll him? Pretend I'm one of the Mr. Tweep candidates. Is Mr. Mr. Tweep uh, in potential? Whatever. He anyway. he wishes. Alright, so, so we have three people. Dhanan123, Nissan DDS and Budumali, aka Prasad Terera from Mr. Tweep. 2013, tweet up SL4. Okay. And uh, we need to get on with the award ceremony, it's getting dark, so let's start with number two. Mr. Tweep, second runner-up, I'm sorry, second place for Mr. Tweep, Nissan the DDS. <laughs> Alright, so number three and number one are right before you. Okay, <laughs> so... In, should I say first place or second place? First place. Anyone? Or second place? First place. Who says second place? You say second place. Who says anything? You're leaving it up to me. You thought? That's nice of you guys. Okay, then I'll just start with first place and third place in Third place for Mr. Tweep 2013. You guys both deserve it. I mean, I feel really bad you know, because one of you guys is going to win the first place and the other guy, and you're going to get this really beautiful pink uh, sash. And the other guy is going to be so jealous when you see the other guy wearing that. You know? I mean, just look at that thing. It's just so gorgeous. And you get the crown? Don't forget the crown. And the crown. Oh my god. Wow, can I have a crown who wins at least for a little while? Okay. Alright, so, fine. In third place, for Mr. Tweep 2013 at Tweet Up FL 4 is... Who's it going to be? Udumale! Shihan. Shihan. Shihan Mirangu. call Shihan here. Shihan Mirangu. Uh, you, you put me off the track. I was like building up to something and now I'm like... Raya all over again. Get on with it. Oh. 
I understand that, but I'm trying to do it. This is a very special moment. I'm trying to make it special for everyone here. But I want to make it the most special moment at Twitter Festival 4. Alright? Okay, before the next award, which is going to be even more special. But, so now... Alright, so I'm just going to go with the first place. I'm just going with the first place. Are you guys okay with that? You guys okay with saying with the first place? Oh. First place, Mr. Tweet, 2013 Tweet of SL4 is... January for Mr. Tweep, so he's going to be on the calendar in our, for the month of January. All right. So let's ask him. Do not want to three congratulations. Let's ask him how he feels about that. Show. As I observed and uh, as I see, I have to uh, pay a tribute to Gaia as well. A really great personality, and uh, I think he deserves this. And uh, if he was there, I won't be here. So I have to mention that as well. Thank you. Another round of applause. Right, for John, thank you very much. I'm sure you would at least been here, definitely. There are three people up here. Watching the down wearing his green, you know, his pink sash. But you get a prize as well, you know. You came here number three. I mean, you beat. I mean, you beat me, for example. You beat, you beat all the guys over there. I mean, ninety percent of the people here are guys, and you beat all of them. I mean, you gotta. That's like that's a great achievement. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Pudumali, Dodan123, and Nissan Sethi. Yes, and this means it's like from all the people on Twitter. But you know, this is my problem. See, if there are a lot of women on Twitter, and there are girls on Twitter, and a lot of guys on Twitter, and the ratio is like almost 50 50. But at. Wait, wait, wait for more. But at Twitter Festival 4, you come here and you see way more guys than girls. That means that a lot of these guys are pretending to be girls. They are pretending to be girls, I know why. To get more followers. To get more replies, to get more retweets. What do you think of that? That does work. Because you know, I mean, I was just following this gorgeous looking girl on Twitter. You know, I was like hoping to meet her today and then I find out, I mean, Hima KK is a guy. I mean, like what? I was developing such a, you know, I was developing my crush on Hima KK and now I find out Hima KK is a guy. Really? This is terrible. You were practically stalking him. This is what I'm talking about, you know. This is my problem with this award, but I mean, all these ladies here are definitely ladies. Is Ayesha. Our next nominee is Takashi G. Takashi G is sports and food loving Takashi G. He eats anything edible as long as it's not poisonous. So any of you guys, you know, interested in knowing things that Takashi G likes, just know that she likes all sorts of sports and she likes food as long as it's edible and not poisonous, right? One more nominee. One more nominee. Already collected one award for the night. And here to collect another, hopefully, three awards out here for three candidates. 
It sounds like he was missing his position up here. But before that, we should probably, I mean, find out why these guys are up here, right? Maybe. Okay. Could you miss come tweet. to the middle, please? What makes a good miss center. tweet? Front and what? center. What makes a good miss tweet? Height? But can you like find out a person's height on Twitter? Height. They are all around the same size. Oh, Aisha is slightly taller. Oh, and now she's... I mean, it's very confusing. I can't really tell from here. Okay, any other criteria for Miss Tweet? But they are on Twitter. And we know, but we're asking you, what about their tweets make them worthy of being Miss Tweet? All right, so helpful, funny, nice, anything else? All right, so we have a request from the audience to get on with it, so shall we get on? Let's get on with it. Okay, so getting on with it, you want to announce the second place winner for Miss Tweet? Yes. Miss Tweet 2013. Third place winner is Takashi G. Takashi G. Remember, she likes sports and food as long as it's not poison. Congratulations on that. Running away. She's always running away. You're not coming to you, yeah? But, but, hey, do you want You're Aisha. And you are? Aisha. Aisha. Oh. So there's a syllable there in the middle, no? Did you guys know this? Yes, yes. Are you, oh, they, they knew it. Oh my god. They know all this already. Okay, great. Uh, so is it going to be Aisha or is it going to be Aisha? Or is it going to be Aisha or is it going to be Aisha? Aisha. Step over here so that everyone can see all. For the photos, people. Think of the photos. All right. Before we start, can we hear it one more time for these three candidates? Which are the ladies over here. Miss Tweet, 2013. Put up for? Aisha and Aisha. Or is it Aisha and Aisha? It's Aisha and Aisha. Aisha and Aisha. Okay. The syllable is, is the difference. All right. So you want to say who the uh, first place so we need to mention who the first place winner for Miss Tweet 2013 and Tweet Up SL4 okay, is so going to be since we're getting on with it let me drum roll please Miss Tweet 2013 in first place is I uh, Aisha Aisha Here is here to present her with the sash that she made. That she made herself, that's the homemade sash. So hey, if I want a pink sash, I can talk to Pumi girl, I guess. No, to Aisha. Oh, you made the sash? Oh, brilliant. I can, great, I can, can I have a pink sash like uh, Dora123? Yeah, now you know where she lives. I know where you live, in Kurunagara. This is one person who lives in Kurunagara, right? And I, if I had, don't go away, you see you stepping away, but you have a prize as well, hang on. Don't pull a Takashi G on us and run away. 